Hi there, it's Johnny. So, last night I posted that I had revamped my hoverboard, and I totally have done that. It is so cool. So you call it a smart board, um, hoverboard, self-balancing board, or how I like to call it, my power-assisted walking device. Sounds way cooler. Um, but my hoverboard is 100% unique. There is nothing like it on the face of the earth. So here's my hoverboard. It was like red or black or gray when I first got it. So I added some duct tape to kind of give it a cool design. And I added and hardwired in LED strips. So when I step on it, the lights blink. It's great at nighttime. It's uh, nice and keeps it nice and safe. People can see me. And it's pretty cool. And I take my feet off, the lights shut off. So how cool is that? So I get about between a two to three hour charge um, and then I have to plug it in. But sometimes there's no place to plug it in, so I have to carry it until I can find an outlet. And then I gotta sit there for an hour to charge it so I can get a bit of a boost. Or I just bring it home and plug it in there. So I built and created a solar panel system so that I can use the sun's energy to charge my hoverboard. So a tiny little one, but I made it work. So I'm just gonna plug it in. And because there's not much light in my room, I would cover up a little bit of the diode here. And as you can see, light just turned back on. So now my hoverboard is now charging off of basically the extra battery backup with the solar power. Um, outside of that, I can use the sun's energy to charge it as well. So I'll unplug it and shut it off. So that's pretty cool. Um, that's patent pending. It's just a great design. It's not perfect, but it works wicked. It gives me an extra half hour of charge. That's pretty much all I need until I can find an outlet. So I can just keep on rolling. Now, the other thing is, I would love to have a hoverboard, much like this one, that would have music. And I could play music. And I was thinking, oh, that'd be wicked. But, so I checked into the Bluetooth hoverboards. The only problem that they have with their system is that the Bluetooth battery component as well runs off the same battery as a regular, as its hoverboard does. So it only gives you between half hour to 45 minutes, max maybe an hour of continuous play. So that's no good. So I created and built, um, being a gadget geek, my own system, my own Bluetooth system, so that I can either use a AC jack to plug in directly from my phone to my hoverboard and just kind of totally listen to music, having the speakers in my system as well. Or I can just use the Bluetooth device with my phone. As well as if somebody calls me, it has cool and crisp, clear, loud sound so that I can just keep on rolling and keep talking to people while I'm on my hoverboard and while my cell phone or my other device is in my pocket. So there's my hoverboard. And here's another cell phone. So I hit play. Put this in my pocket. That's completely synced. And so this is my hoverboard now. So give me a thumbs up if you think that's pretty cool. And let me know what you think. Thanks for watching.